is it sleep that's the cause of things or is sleep a symptom? And if we look at sleep, what can that actually tell us about what's going on with other people's physical and mental health? Because I think that's really the key is not necessarily seeing sleep and I must fix it as as the problem, but really seeing what can we learn from sleep. Really nice example, someone I saw today who's in their early 20s, complex PTSD, ADHD, borderline personality disorder, collection of all of those. Not surprisingly, goes to bed at 10, but doesn't sleep till 3 a.m., sets an alarm for seven, wishing to get up, but feels tired when they get up. Lots of nightmares, lots of restlessness during sleep sent along to basically make their sleep conform to an idealized social norm of I go to sleep at 10 and I wake at six and I get to the office at nine and I don't feel tired during the day. Now, that's a totally non-biological way of thinking about sleep. 